Welcome to the highlights of Malaysia's economic performance for second quarter 2019. In the second quarter of 2019, Malaysia's economy expanded to 4.9%. On external sector, Malaysia's current account surplus recorded 14.3 billion ringgit. In terms of investment, FDI recorded an inflow of 4.4 billion ringgit from 21.7 billion ringgit in previous quarter. The world economy scenario is facing a challenging environment. Economy for advanced countries such as United States of America, United Kingdom, European Union, and Singapore moderated, while South Korea improved in this quarter. Price statistics in this quarter shows that the Consumer Price Index increased to 0.7% from negative 0.3% in the last quarter. Furthermore, Producer Price Index still recorded negative growth in this quarter. Services Producer Price Index SPPI, increased to 0.7%. Index of Services grew at 6.4%. In addition, the expansion in Industrial Production Index was contributed by manufacturing and mining. Labor market condition remained favorable. The labor participation rate improved to 68.8% with unemployment remained stable at 3.3%. Looking at the scenario for the second quarter 2019, all sectors recorded positive growth on the supply side. The growth of 4.9% was supported by services and manufacturing by registering a growth of 6.1% and 4.3% respectively. In addition, agriculture grew 4.2%, mainly supported by oil palm and other agriculture subsectors. Furthermore, mining and quarrying rebounded 2.9%, whereby construction recorded a marginal growth of 0.5% in this quarter. On the expenditure side, domestic demand supported the growth in this quarter. Household consumption expanded 7.8% and net exports increased to 22.9%. Malaysia's current account balance continued to record a surplus of 14.3 billion ringgit in the second quarter of 2019. Financial account in this quarter posted a net outflow of 18.6 billion ringgit. This was largely due to a net outflow in portfolio investment and direct investment. FDI recorded a lower inflow of 4.4 billion ringgit. The investment were mainly from Hong Kong, United States of America, and Ireland. Meanwhile, the IA surged to 12.6 billion ringgit from 5.5 billion ringgit in previous quarter. The main destinations of DIA were Netherlands, United Kingdom, and Cayman Islands. We do hope this highlight will provide some insights of Malaysia's economic performance in the second quarter of 2019. Concurrently, Malaysia will be hosting the International Statistical Institute World Statistics Congress 2019, ISI WSC 2019, which will be held from 18 to 23rd August 2019 at the Kuala Lumpur Convention Center, KLCC. Among the interesting themes that will be covered during the Congress are official statistics, survey methodology, and data science. Thank you for watching and catch up on the latest statistics at our social media. Assalamualaikum and Salam Sejahtera.